Hey guys, it's November 4th, but I took a look at the forecast and you know what I saw and what I noticed? The temps right now are similar to what we see in the spring for the prime maple syrup sap running season. I just wanted to do a little experiment and see if the trees would run right now, given those conditions. All right, we're about one half mile south of the world headquarters right now in the original maple woods. And I'm gonna look for a tree to conduct my little experiment. Right there we have a tapping hammer, specially designed for tapping trees. A drill bit with a tapping bit. So let's get right in it. I found a tree right here on the edge of the woods. Let's see what happens. Would you look at that? Much to my surprise, this was running a lot better than I thought. So what I'm gonna do here is put a stainless steel bag spout in it and then give it a few taps to seed it. Take a look at that. That thing's running faster than it does in the springtime. I mean, it's as good as any time I've ever seen it in the spring. Wow, I didn't expect that. Okay, so this thing is more of a traditional way of gathering sap. It's a plastic bag with a metal holder on the top. We'll put that on there and see how much we get. Later in the afternoon, about four or five hours later, it's still dripping pretty good. Looks like we got about a gallon in there. This thing I have in my left hand is a digital refractometer. It's gonna measure the sugar content of the sap. This is gonna be our final test, and this is gonna let us know just how potent the sap coming out of that tree is in the fall. I've heard that it is lower in the fall, but let's look. 3.9? That's crazy. That's like over a point to a point and a half higher than what we see in the spring. That's super high sugar content. That'll make a lot of syrup real quickly. Let's do the math. So I did the math. It's only about 22 gallons of sap to make one gallon of maple syrup. That's only about half what you would normally figure. Guys, I hope you enjoyed this. I hope you found it entertaining. I hope you found it enlightening and informational. Have a great weekend and remember always keep it real.